tell me that I'm never gonna make it. They want me to do something that can make it. Hello there, eco-conscious enthusiasts and agriculture aficionados. Welcome back to Tropics Farming, your go-to destination for all things green and growing. Today, we're diving deep into a fascinating comparison, hydroponic versus traditional soil farming. As we explore these two distinct methods, we'll shed light on the pros and cons of each, all in the pursuit of a more sustainable and efficient future of farming. But before we plunge into the details, let's take a moment to appreciate the undeniable importance of sustainable agriculture. Our planet's resources are precious, and finding innovative ways to produce food while minimizing our environmental impact has never been more critical. From rising populations to shifting climate patterns, the challenges facing agriculture are diverse and demanding. It's not just about growing more, it's about growing smarter. And that's where hydroponic and traditional soil farming step onto the stage. Hydroponic farming, a cutting-edge approach, challenges the conventional norms. It's a method that doesn't rely on soil, and instead, nurtures plants in nutrient-rich water solutions. It's like a high-tech spa day for your veggies. Meanwhile, traditional soil farming has been the backbone of agriculture for centuries. It's a practice rooted in the Earth's natural processes, where plants draw nutrients from the soil and work in harmony with the ecosystem around them. Throughout this video, we'll weigh the advantages and drawbacks of each method. We'll explore how hydroponics can supercharge plant growth, using mind-boggling technologies that even Mother Nature might envy. And we'll see how good old-fashioned soil farming has its own set of unique perks, including the wisdom of generations etched into its practices. So, buckle up, green thumbs and curious minds, as we journey through the lush landscapes of hydroponic wonders and the comforting embrace of traditional soil farms. By the end of this video, you'll have a clearer understanding of these farming methods and be better equipped to make informed choices that contribute to a sustainable and thriving future. Let's dive into the world of hydroponic farming, a cutting-edge method that challenges traditional soil-based agriculture. Hydroponics, in simple terms, is the practice of growing plants without soil. Instead, plants are suspended in nutrient-rich water solutions that provide all the nourishment they need to flourish. At the heart of hydroponics are three key components, nutrient solutions, growing mediums, and water circulation. Nutrient solutions are meticulously formulated blends of essential minerals and nutrients that are dissolved in water, providing plants with their vital sustenance. Growing mediums are used to anchor the plants and provide support, allowing their roots to access the nutrient-rich water. These mediums can include materials like perlite, coconut coir, or even simply air in some advanced systems. Water circulation is the dynamic force that transports the nutrient solutions to the plant roots and ensures they receive a consistent supply of nourishment. It's like a well-choreographed dance, keeping the plants hydrated and healthy. One of the standout advantages of hydroponic farming is its remarkable water efficiency. Traditional soil farming often requires copious amounts of water, much of which can go unused or be lost to evaporation. In hydroponics, water is recirculated within the system, drastically reducing consumption. Hydroponic systems create controlled environments where every aspect, from light to temperature and nutrients, can be fine-tuned. This precision results in faster growth rates, meaning plants reach maturity quicker than in traditional soil setup. Limited space. No problem. Hydroponics truly shines when it comes to space efficiency. By utilizing vertical farming techniques and compact setups, hydroponic farms can produce a significant amount of food in a fraction of the space required by conventional soil farming. While hydroponics offers an array of benefits, it's important to consider the initial investment. Setting up a hydroponic system can incur higher costs due to the specialized equipment, infrastructure, and technology required to create and maintain the optimal growing conditions. Hydroponic farming demands a level of technical expertise. Monitoring and adjusting factors like nutrient levels, pH balance, and lighting require a keen understanding of plant biology and system dynamics. It's a labor of love that requires constant attention. Just as any system, hydroponics is not immune to potential failures. Power outages, equipment malfunctions, or disruptions in water circulation can impact plant health and yield. It's a reminder that even advanced methods have their vulnerabilities. Now, let's shift our focus to the time-tested method of traditional soil farming, a practice deeply rooted in our history. This approach involves cultivating crops directly in the soil, drawing upon the Earth's natural processes to nurture and sustain plant growth. Tr has played a pivotal role in shaping civilizations and ensuring food security for countless generations. It's a method that's not just about producing crops, but about fostering a harmonious relationship with the land. One of the standout advantages of traditional soil farming is the rich tapestry of natural nutrients that soil provide. As plants grow, they draw upon a diverse array of minerals and nutrients present in the soil, creating a balanced and wholesome source of nourishment. 
Moreover, the soil is home to a complex web of microorganisms that contribute to plant health. These microscopic allies, from beneficial bacteria to fungi, form a dynamic ecosystem that supports the growth and resilience of crops. Unlike the complex machinery and technology associated with hydroponics, traditional soil farming tends to rely on simpler tools and equipment. Farmers often use basic implements like plows, hoes, and watering cans, making this method accessible to a wider range of individuals. Traditional soil farming boasts a natural resilience that comes from working in harmony with the environment. Soil-based systems have evolved over centuries to adapt to various climatic conditions and fluctuations. This resilience can lend a degree of stability, even in the face of certain environmental challenges. While traditional soil farming has its merits, it does come with some drawbacks. One significant concern is water usage. Soil-based farming often requires larger amounts of water to ensure plants receive adequate hydration, which can strain water resources, particularly in arid regions. Plants grown in soil-based systems may have longer growth cycles compared to their hydroponic counterparts. The natural processes of soil interaction and nutrient uptake can lead to slightly slower growth rates, requiring more time before crops are ready for harvest. Another consideration is the need for larger land areas in traditional farming. Soil-based methods demand expanses of arable land, which can limit the potential for farming in densely populated or urban areas. As we've seen, traditional soil farming has its own unique set of advantages and challenges. Join us as we continue to delve deeper into the comparison between hydroponic and traditional soil farming. As we wrap up our journey through the realms of hydroponic and traditional soil farming, let's take a moment to recap the advantages and disadvantages we've explored. Hydroponic farming dazzles with its water efficiency, accelerated growth, and space-saving capability. However, it does come with an initial investment, technical complexities, and vulnerabilities to system failures. On the other hand, traditional soil farming shines with its natural nutrient supply, reduced equipment dependency, and inherent resilience. Yet, it also presents challenges in terms of water consumption, slower growth rates, and land requirements. The future of agriculture holds incredible promise as we explore innovative ways to meet the demands of a growing population while safeguarding our planet's resources. Combining the strengths of hydroponic and traditional soil farming could pave the way for a harmonious coexistence that enhances both sustainability and efficiency. Technological advancements continue to shape the landscape of farming. From AI-driven crop monitoring to precision nutrient delivery, the marriage of technology with both hydroponic and traditional methods holds tremendous potential to optimize resource usage and maximize yields. In this age of conscious consumerism, it's vital to heed the preferences and values of those who consume the fruits of our labor. The choice between hydroponic and traditional farming is not just about yield, but also about providing options that align with consumer desires for locally sourced, sustainable, and nutrient-rich produce. We've only scratched the surface of this captivating discussion. We invite you, our engaged and curious viewers, to share your thoughts and experiences in the comments section below. Your insights can enrich the conversation and spark new ideas. For those eager to learn more, consider embarking on a journey to your local farmers markets and agricultural fairs. These vibrant hubs of knowledge and tradition offer a hands-on opportunity to connect with farmers and discover the intricacies of different farming methods. We want to extend our heartfelt gratitude for joining us on this exploration of hydroponic versus traditional soil farming. Your commitment to understanding sustainable agriculture is truly inspiring. If you found this video informative and thought-provoking, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell. Together, we can sow the seeds of a greener and more sustainable future. Until next time, keep nurturing your love for all things green. There's nobody on my level They think that work is too stressful I think that work is essential The grind is all in your mental And I don't think you understand what I'll go through Just to be in control of my life soon
dreaming I'll be famous But I don't give a fuck, I'm gonna keep chasing I got all this potential that's deep inside of me But they hate when you're successful cause they try to be They sit there being just mental because you're trying things And they just want you to settle and do the right thing So get a good job, don't slack off Wake up every morning, make a good impression on your boss Don't do anything that I wouldn't do And when you're making money, make sure you don't spend it too soon <laughs> Fuck that, I'll do what I wanna do I got a different path from everyone and that includes you Who are you to tell me how to live life In these times it feels like nobody is right, yeah So I'ma figure out what else we succeed And then invest all of my time into that and proceed I need whatever the hell could make me happy And I don't think you have a clue what could that be They tell me that I'm never gonna make it They want me to do something that can make sense They hate when I keep dreaming I'll be famous Tell me that I'm never gonna make it They want me to do something that can make sense They hate when I keep dreaming I'll be famous But I don't give a fuck, I'ma keep chasing I think this life could be special if I get rid of the devils They think that I am a rebel, I think they want me to settle There's nobody on my level, they think that work is too stressful I think that work is essential, the grind is all in your mental And I don't think you understand what I'll go through Just to be in control of my life soon all the negativity, man, I'm immune. I don't really need a mask with all I've been through. I've been making changes for the ages. Five, ten year plans are contagious. I attack that shit, I'm tenacious. And if you ain't, get the fuck out of my way then. Got one life, I won't regret it. I will fight until I get it. I'll look back one day from heaven and say, damn, I learned some lessons. And say, damn, I have no questions. I had fun in every second and the journey was a blessing, yeah. They tell me that I'm never gonna make it. They want me to do something that can make sense. They hate when I keep dreaming.